In today's globalized world, piracy has evolved from an act confined to the high seas to a complex transnational crime. Facilitated by cyberspace and emerging technologies like drones, this evolution presents unprecedented challenges to international law, pushing the boundaries of existing legal frameworks and raising critical questions about jurisdiction, evidence gathering, and international cooperation. This complexity underscores the need for a nuanced understanding of how piracy intersects with cyberspace and drones, the legal issues it raises, and the potential solutions that can ensure the effective prosecution of pirates in the 21st century. 1. Piracy in Cyberspace Piracy in cyberspace refers to criminal activities carried out in the online realm that have traditionally been associated with piracy at sea. It encompasses acts like the theft of data, cyber attacks targeting maritime infrastructure, and disruption of shipping operations. While these activities may not directly involve physical acts of violence or detention at sea, they can have significant impacts on maritime commerce and national security. For instance, cyber attacks on shipping companies can disrupt critical operations, causing delays, financial losses, and even endangering lives. Similarly, the theft of confidential data can compromise sensitive information and intellectual property. Before we continue, please take some time to subscribe to our channel. If you find our videos helpful, please support us. One of the primary challenges in addressing piracy in cyberspace is the difficulty of applying the existing legal definitions to online activities. Traditionally, piracy has been defined under the United Nations Convention on the Law of the Sea as any illegal acts of violence or detention, or threat of violence or detention, committed for private ends by the crew of a private ship or aircraft and directed against another ship or aircraft or against persons or property found at sea. This definition, however, was established long before the advent of cyberspace and was primarily intended to address acts of robbery and violence on the high seas. Therefore, extending this definition to cyberspace requires a careful consideration of the unique characteristics of the online environment and the potential implications for international law. Another challenge is the issue of jurisdiction. Determining where a cyber piracy offense takes place is complex, since it can involve multiple actors and servers in different jurisdictions. For example, a cyber attack could be initiated by a pirate residing in one country. Target a ship sailing through international waters and be facilitated by servers located in another country. This jurisdictional complexity makes it difficult to identify the appropriate legal authority to investigate and prosecute the crime, often leading to a situation where no country feels compelled to take action due to a lack of clear jurisdiction. This ambiguity not only hampers the prosecution of cyber pirates, but also creates loopholes that criminals can exploit to evade justice. Gathering sufficient evidence to support a prosecution is also a significant challenge. Unlike traditional piracy cases, where evidence can be gathered at sea or on land, evidence in cyber piracy cases often requires specialized skills to collect and preserve. This includes obtaining digital evidence, tracing the source of the attack, and identifying the perpetrators involved. Moreover, Preserving the integrity of digital evidence is crucial to ensure its admissibility in court. This requires expertise to prevent contamination or alteration of data, which can be easily compromised in a networked environment. Furthermore, overcoming language barriers and differing legal standards across jurisdictions poses another hurdle. In cases where evidence is gathered or witnesses are located in foreign countries, the process of obtaining and presenting evidence can be complicated by differences in legal systems, languages, and cultural norms. This complexity can lead to delays and difficulties in building a strong prosecution case. International cooperation is vital for effectively countering cyber piracy, yet it remains a challenge. Sharing information, coordinating investigations, and executing search warrants across borders requires seamless cooperation. However, differences in legal traditions, political considerations, and enforcement capabilities can hinder such cooperation. Building trust and establishing effective communication channels are essential for overcoming these challenges. But they often require significant diplomatic and logistical efforts. The effective prosecution of cyber pirates necessitates a concerted international response that addresses these challenges head-on. Strengthening international cooperation Harmonizing legal frameworks and investing in capacity building are crucial steps in this endeavor. By working collaboratively, nations can create a robust, 
legal, and operational environment that deters cyber piracy and ensures the safety of maritime commerce in the digital age. To drones and piracy. Drones have emerged as valuable tools for pirates seeking to enhance their illicit activities. These unmanned aerial vehicles are relatively affordable, easy to use and capable of operating with a high degree of stealth, making them attractive for reconnaissance, surveillance, and even offensive missions. Pirates use them to identify lucrative targets, monitor vessel movements, and gather intelligence that can be used to plan more effective attacks. Additionally, drones can be equipped with sensors and cameras that allow pirates to assess the vulnerability of potential targets without risking their own presence. Some drones can even be used to deliver small payloads or to create distractions, further increasing their utility for pirates. Moreover, the proliferation of drones has made them more accessible to criminal organizations, contributing to their growing popularity among pirates. As drone technology continues to advance and become more widely available, it is likely that pirates will continue to integrate them into their operations, posing new challenges to maritime security. Addressing the use of drones in piracy requires a comprehensive approach that considers the unique aspects of these unmanned vehicles. First, existing international law, particularly the rules of engagement for the use of force at sea, needs to be carefully reviewed and adapted to account for the use of drones in piracy. Establishing clear rules of engagement is essential for naval vessels or authorized entities to respond appropriately to drone-related threats. This includes defining when the use of force is authorized, what level of force is proportionate, and how to verify the legitimacy of drone operations. International cooperation is also crucial in this regard, to ensure consistency and interoperability among different naval forces. Attribution and accountability are critical when dealing with drone-related piracy. Establishing the origin and control of the drones used in piracy attempts is essential for holding the perpetrators accountable. This can be challenging, particularly when drones are operated remotely or autonomously. It's making it difficult to identify the individuals or groups responsible. However, advanced tracking and surveillance technologies can help gather intelligence on drone activities, potentially leading to the identification of the individuals or entities involved. International collaboration is key to sharing intelligence and conducting joint operations to attribute responsibility and bring the perpetrators to justice. Furthermore, it is important to consider the legal aspects of drone operations in counter-piracy efforts. This includes addressing issues such as the legality of drone surveillance, the use of force against drones, and the protection of civilian vessels and personnel from drone-related threats. Adhering to international humanitarian law and human rights law is crucial to ensure that counter-piracy operations conducted with drones are lawful and do not result in unlawful acts. 3. Cyberspace and Drones the intersection of cyberspace and drones poses a unique and evolving set of challenges for international law. So the use of drones in maritime operations, whether by pirates or law enforcement agencies, is increasingly prevalent, and the potential for cyber attacks on these drones is significant. As drones become smaller, cheaper, and more autonomous, they offer both opportunities and risks in the maritime domain. Understanding the legal implications of this convergence is essential for ensuring the safety and security of maritime activities. One significant concern is the risk of cyber-enabled drone attacks. Drones can be hacked or hijacked remotely, enabling attackers to gain control over the drone and manipulate it for malicious purposes. This could involve using a compromised drone to deliver explosives, disrupt operations, or conduct surveillance. The anonymity and remote nature of drone operations make it difficult to trace the source of the attack. Complicating efforts to hold the perpetrators accountable, legal frameworks need to be developed to address the attribution and liability issues arising from such cyber-enabled attacks. Protecting sensitive data related to maritime operations is another critical concern. Drones often collect, store, and transmit vast amounts of data, including vessel movements, cargo information, and navigational data. Cyber attacks targeting these data could compromise national security interests disrupt critical operations, or provide valuable intelligence to pirates. Implementing robust cybersecurity measures to safeguard sensitive data against cyber attacks is essential. This includes investing in secure data transmission protocols, encryption, and access controls to limit the risk of unauthorized access or manipulation. Moreover, 
International cooperation is crucial for addressing the legal challenges posed by the intersection of cyberspace and drones. Sharing best practices, conducting joint exercises and harmonizing regulations can help ensure the safe and lawful use of drones in maritime environments. Collaborative efforts are also essential for responding to incidents involving compromised drones or cyber attacks on maritime operations. As technology continues to evolve, the challenges posed by the intersection of cyberspace and drones will continue to change. Adapting legal frameworks, promoting international cooperation, and fostering innovation in maritime. Security are vital for ensuring the safety and resilience of maritime. Activities in an increasingly complex and interconnected world. Four, scientific aspects. Forensic analysis plays a pivotal role in cases involving piracy in cyberspace and drones. Advanced forensic techniques are necessary to analyze the vast amounts of digital data involved in cyber piracy investigations. This includes recovering deleted files, analyzing network traffic, and creating timelines of events to reconstruct the sequence of the attack. Additionally, geospatial and digital forensics can help trace the source of drone-related threats, providing valuable insights into the individuals or groups responsible for malicious activities. Artificial intelligence has immense potential for enhancing maritime security and combating piracy. AI-powered systems can monitor vast stretches of coastline and seafaring vessels, detecting anomalies and suspicious activities in real time. Predictive modeling algorithms can forecast piracy hotspots based on factors like weather patterns, vessel movements, and historical data. By integrating AI into maritime security operations, authorities can allocate resources more efficiently, focusing on high-risk areas and potential targets. Moreover, AI-driven anomaly detection systems can identify unusual behaviors or patterns that may indicate piracy attempts or cyber attacks, enabling timely interventions. Blockchain technology offers unique opportunities to enhance transparency and traceability in global supply chains, thereby reducing the prevalence of piracy. By recording transactions in an immutable and auditable manner, blockchain can provide a tamper-proof record of a shipment's journey from origin to destination. This enhanced visibility allows for real-time tracking, simplifying customs procedures and deterring pirates who rely on obscured or falsified data for their illicit activities. Additionally, smart contracts can automate and secure various aspects of international trade, reducing the opportunities for piracy and facilitating seamless trade transactions. As technology continues to advance, staying ahead of the curve and embracing innovative solutions is essential for effectively countering piracy in cyberspace and drones investing in research and development, fostering public-private partnerships, and promoting international. Collaboration are crucial steps in harnessing the power of science and technology to protect maritime interests. By embracing innovation, we can create a safer and more secure maritime environment for global trade and prosperity.